All right, yes, you welcome back to the Balance Diet of Teletainment this morning. With that new stop of the hour, the next boss of all the enter. Now, one Kaja guest will be Waka with better swag. Enter inside our premises and we cash them, hold them. Because the next thing you know, if you just do abracadabra and if you disappear, there's not one young magician. We can show us the superpowers where you get more watch out. Abracadabra! Of course, we they always hear that particular one when some kind of magician them won't perform some kind of tricks on top of our dormant. And that's now why we get this very young, fantastic magician. He's not Ninja personal, and he don't get this fashion. Since when he did five years of age, now he don't enter the legal age, and he's inside here with us to share some of the experience we get. Me, I feel officially give him, as a Wazobia person, the first young magician who we don't get for inside Wazobia Max premises. Welcome, Bam Skadini. Thank you. you. I'm fine, fine. Beautiful. So now we don't they talk about um tell me about your passion. What did make you want to go into magic? What did you see? What bring out the passion for your body? Okay, like firstly, um as a young guy, I like being unique. Like, I see people go into music, um singing, rapping, dancing, but I don't like like I don't like competitions like yeah, just like doing something unique, something someone someone else is not doing as good as I'm doing it. So I started to become a magician. I'm a skateboarder. I know skateboarding is rare in Nigeria. Yes, I started to choose skateboarding. So I actually went to magic when I saw magicians on TV. And I was like, don't you have a magician in Nigeria here? Yeah. And I couldn't find any, even just one to teach me how it's done. Because it, they freak me out a lot on TV. Like, is this even possible? So I'm, I, had a, I had a passion, like, I must know how this is done. I must start doing it. I must become one of them. But yeah, I am today. So now you'll be talking to so you be one learner, you be one norm. And nobody there as a mentor, as a role model for Inside Niger to actually teach you the tricks and tips on top of how to be a magician. How you take on learner? Okay, um, we started with uh, magic and science, you know. I was a science, like, I was a science student when I was in school. So we, we do some science experiments and they're like magic, you understand? So we still implement science into magic sometimes. And also when I go to um, Yabatek, when I started my ND, I met a guy who had the same. Probably I don't know if he had the same dream with me because he's no longer a, magi a magician now. I don't know why he stopped. But I met him and I saw him doing this and I was like, yeah, this is very easy, I can do it also. So the next day I grabbed my deck of cards. I, he gave me some tips. That was how I became a magician. Like it was very, it was going smooth for me because he told me he learned it under like two years or so. But I learned mine in two days. Wow. Yeah. Something where you learn in two years, you learn them for two days. Mm, beautiful. Tell us some of the um, uh, challenges. How you they take convince if you just like now you just come meeting and tell me say oh I, I yes you be magician. How you go take convince that person say you really sabi magic. Okay, as for me. Um, I just don't say I'm a magician. Like, I'm always trying to say that. What I do is, um, I just meet you up and I'm like, I want to show you something. If you're cool with it, uh, if I can actually tell you I'm, I want to show you magic, but most of them, I'm like, I want to show you something. And whenever I bring my cards, they'll be like, their mind like, oh, is he a gambler or a trickster? So most people know magicians to so be using cards to do tricks and stuff. So once they see me with cards, they know what I want to do. So it's up to them to say continue, or uh, if they say no, then I just back on like you. It's your loss, not my loss. You didn't. <laughs> now I know say sometimes when they see magician for television, mm -hmm. a lot of sometimes, not every time, they, they wear long sleeve. I don't know if they have anything up their sleeves, because now I'm seeing that you're wearing long sleeve. Yeah. And you're on my set. Do we have anything up the sleeve? No. Um. <laughs> you just like the long sleeve. Just it looks cool on us, like no, like just a yeah, fashion so wise. Yeah. So I don't like long sleeve. I don't I, personally. I don't like short sleeves. Like that's for me. So for for magician, the long sleeve has got nothing to do with the profession, with the no, no, no. with we the passion. No, 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 no. So now for for this course where they run now, tell us some of the things we don't discourage you from following this dream where you get. Mm. As for me, whenever I want to do something, if you like um, discourage me, give me any bad um, motivation, I'll still do what I want to do. This is what this is my dream. This is my passion. They, I don't want to know what obstacle will come through me and I won't, I'll just ignore everything. Because yeah, people be like, oh, I know this is done, I know this is done. I'm like, yo, get some deck and try and do it and see if you can actually do it. So this kind of, there's some guys, they call them air class. They feel, oh, yo, you can't deceive them. 
But eventually, I'll still do my best. I'll do what I can do, and I'll still deceive them. And fine, yeah, as a Nigerian parent, your parents, will never, I doubt if any parents ever support you. Even though you are, if you are playing football, you want to become a musician, I doubt if they support you at first. Because they won't, they would won't, they would not want you to, you know, go away from education and stuff. Because I want to ask whether your pale or male, no carry you go shorts the first time when you come outside, talk, say, this is not way they're passionate about. Because African setting, magician, they are almost uh, synonymous uh, with voodoo. Yeah. And in some cases, the parents will say, to fear aqua. To fear aqua. <laughs> it is not my son's portion. My parents are not like, you know, what I'll say is that uh, most of Nigerians, like, they are being brainwashed by this religion and stuff. You should understand that magicians are like entertainer. This is what they do. They, are, they can sh make you see the impossible. So, so they should make a prayer request. They should mm, make it a prayer request. My dad knows. So cast like, and bind. He's aware of whatever I'm doing. Like every trick I'm doing, he's, he knows how it's done. Like even though I was, if I show him and he was like, wow, how did you do this? I was still explaining to him because he knows like, oh, my son does not have any spiritual power. And uh, it's not a yahoo yahoo thing. No, no, no. Just like I'm gifted. That. Like I can do this and I can do that. Beautiful. Okay, because I see so you get some coins, you get some coins in your hand and you have some cards. You don't do that where they bring out coins from the house. <laughs> you don't, you don't, like, when you see a magician, you don't ask him to do something. Let him just do what he wants to do. Oh, as the spirit leads. Yeah. So they say do the flow. Okay, so give us some tips and um, some myths. Let's debunk some myths about magicians and the mag and some things that, that they say about them. And then uh, some tips for people then where one doing, where actually they're passionate, they never get the liver where you get to come out boldly and talk say now what are they passionate about what is it to tell those ones so if you want to become a magician or you want to do something just i don't know you have to follow your dream like for me i used to say um if you are meant to be a magician then don't worry magic will come for you by itself like i i wasn't actually struggling to be a magician like it just came like i just not like oh i have to be a, you know the um, footballers how they practice and how they do this uh, just to achieve but me i didn't i just saw that one day and the guy just came across. So if a professional, a magician, the best way done inside the industry, come, won't come perform your magic for you. You know, go they fascinated by the tricks and things where they do. Mm, I won't I just like um come down and watch what he wants to do. Because um this guy I know all the concepts. So if you're doing anything for me, you I won't be you sure you know all the concepts. Yeah. What would you wish if you get that that power or the wand, the <laughs> magical wand, to wave it all around? What's it be that one to where you go feel one change? Is it changing this country or changing my life? Eh? Change as a magician. Uh, so it's, it's, a, it's an open check question. Change as a magician, but it's just one wish or one thing. What will be that thing where you will want to? As a magician, no. Uh, yeah. Like, I want to be like one of the best and pull out the craziest like magic stuff that anyone can ever do. So let's see you perform the magic. Uh, okay. Let's see you do it. Um, I think so I, have, I have two coins here. Can you give me a hand? So um, I have two coins here. Are you guys seeing this? So I want you to just um, fold your hand immediately. I'm coming. I'm going to grab this. So what you do for me is, are you ready? Yeah. You fold your hand immediately. I want them to see this. So one, two, fold your hand immediately. Like that. Shake it very well. Shake it like, give it some space. Like that. One, two, like that. Now I want you to open your hand. Open your hand. And you can actually check them. No, no, do it again, do it again. I tell you, I don't do the same trick twice. But we can actually try it. <laughs> Are you guys seeing my facial expression? Like <laughs> so she's picking a card. Just pick one, just touch. Okay, take. Look at your card. Look at it, show it to the camera. Come in, let me. Are you done? Now drop a card back inside there. Don't worry, we'll, we'll mix the card so. This is the best to shuffle all cards. Now, I have my phone here. I don't know if the camera can see this. Can you see this? Yeah. I have a normal phone here. But when I shake the phone, the card comes out. I'm looking right. Oh, I'm coming. Oh wow, trust me, I'd be really, really enjoy myself 
for um, for that interview because uh, I never ever see physically a real real magician. How much more in Ninja magician? It was uh, it was quite fascinating. And uh, when I try to tell I may do one or two so that go catch catch some of the tricks. The guy say you don't tell a magician what trick to do. To enjoy more of this, our will get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.